To get things started, I just added a video clip to my timeline. Before we begin, you want to make sure you have an unused audio track that you can record your voiceover on. If you need an extra track, right click on one of your audio tracks and select Add Track. Ok, let's start by right clicking our audio track and selecting Customize. Then drag the microphone icon for voiceover recording onto your audio track next to the S. We also want to drag the R icon on there which will allow us to enable recording. Next, we need to make sure our microphone is correctly set up before we record. Go to Edit, Preferences, Audio Hardware. Set the default input to your microphone if it isn't already. Next, let's head over to the Audio tab. In here, you want to make sure you have checked the New Input During Recording option. This way, if you're recording voiceover while a video is playing, it's not going to create an echoing feedback loop. Ok, we're done in here, so just hit OK. Back on our timeline, click the R next to your audio track to enable recording. Before we start recording, I'm just going to show you a few quick settings by right clicking on my audio track and selecting Voice Over Record Settings. Both post roll and pre roll are timers that count down to recording. Post roll starts your timer while your footage is playing. I don't use this, so I'm going to leave it off. Pre roll, on the other hand, starts a timer on a black screen before the recording starts. I want this on. One more thing to know is that you can change your audio recording sources here rather than going back to preferences. Ok, now position your time head to where you want the recording to start and then click the microphone button to start recording. Alright, this is a test recording. To stop recording, just hit the space bar or click the microphone again. Now when I play this back, I now have an easy voiceover in Premiere. Alright, this is a test recording. Alright, that's it for now. Thanks for watching and see you next time.